I'm ready. So in today's video of Will It Dent, you're gonna notice uh, coatings, we're profiling coatings. But this is really the backbone of the system and will be embedded in the system. This is a spun flex two fabric. It's stretchable uh, both ways, but more uh, this way. Um, specially woven in order to get that characteristic. Uh, and this is made by the Conklin Company. Now, we're gonna embed this in the system so that it's beneath the surface and uh, it's gonna give us a lot of strength so that when we hit stuff against it, it's not gonna hurt it. So uh, before we actually hit the coating board, we're gonna try on a few things that are not coating, such as this inch and a half ISO board. We know it'll blow through it, but uh, it's fun to watch. Smashed it, dude. Now we're going to be hitting a uh, half inch sheet of OSB. Cold. That bottom one's the one that uh, Garrett blew right through it. Oh, low! You dented it. Thanks, spot. Yeah. Well, a couple inches away. <laughs> Hit that one. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> That wasn't even 100%. Nice hit. That one definitely hit. Man, I was hoping that we'd beat that a lot harder than that. Uh, 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 you ready, man? Yeah, this is gonna be awesome. Mark? Yeah. He almost hit Brandon, <laughs> but he didn't hit the board. That was a good one. That was nice. I should have just stayed over there. <laughs> That's a dent. That was at least 15% of my power. We want to try to get this ball to go through that coating. That's our goal. So Brandon's the last one up on deck. Go Brandon, you're our only hope. <laughs> easy, easy. Yeah. I think that broke too. Oh, that hit. Oh yeah. Sweet. But it won't break through. Golf ball hit here. Uh, there was two golf balls hit here that hit pretty close. One was Brandon and one was Garrett, so that's probably why that uh, blew that out a little bit more. But it's press, it's impressive. You can see another one right here. One right there. One right here. Well. So it's actually compromising the back side of the plywood. Another one here. And uh, wow, that's, that's pretty impressive. Because from the front, it didn't look like there was any damage. So I was kind of a little uh, uh, disappointed that maybe the test wasn't working out well. But this obviously shows that there's damage. So that was a hail strike hit, hit from above. It maybe damaged the, the substrate, but the surface still stays intact. So I can actually pull, you can see that there we got the wood, the primer, the base coat, and in the middle of the base coat, we got the fabric. I'm actually gonna pull this apart so you can see, you can see that that uh, primer stuck to the board, the base coat stuck to the primer, and it's just uh, coming apart. So I've had some critics tell me that coating really isn't that tough. So. Uh, they challenge me to uh, put something on my forehead and then take a shot at my head with a golf ball. I'm not sure it'll work, but uh, I am very uh, excited to prove how uh, tough and durable this is. So 
we're gonna put this right up here. Is this right where you wanna put it, Garrett? Mm -hmm. Like this. Hopefully I can get this off my head when we're done. Oh! Oh, I think that's a wrap, guys. I think that's a wrap. Oh! Cut!